Um, if you don't mind, Miss Fiona, I have an observation to make. Okay, go ahead. Yes, this is a crucial meeting where we are supposed to make our decisions and then communicate it as board members. But that's why we're here. We are going to discuss extensively and reach a conclusion. But as you can see, your brother, this man is not here. And how can we then take decision or take decide on anything without him? Yes, he is supposed to be here and give us feedback on the assignment that was given to him. Well, unfortunately, my brother will not be available for this meeting. He has gone to take care of something very important for the family. What is wrong with you, Desmond? Huh? You were supposed to be part of this meeting going on. I just covered up for you. I told them you went to take care of something very important. Now tell me why you can't let my phone rest. Your phone is not going to rest. You hear me? Your phone will not rest. Listen, something just happened. I need money and I need it urgently. What do you need it for? Listen, 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 listen. You're biting more than you can chew. Make that transfer now. I'm not joking with you. Desmond, I give you a generous allowance. More than enough to live off. What do you want now? Oh, you have some guts. You gave me money, so? So what? Listen, you don't lecture me on what I do with money. Well, now I should spend money, my own money. Listen, you are biting more than you can chew. I'm not joking with you. When I say I need money, when I ask you to send money, you send money. I'm sorry. You will have to wait till next week. I have to wait till next week. <laughs> I have to wait till next week. You know, it's really not your fault. I blame Dad. I blame him for all this nonsense, this insult that you're giving me now. I said send money. You're telling me you can't send money till next week. It's not your fault. Father placed you where you were not supposed to be. That's why you have this energy. That's why you have this God to tell me how to spend my own money. If Father were here, would you try all this nonsense? It's not, so you have to deal with it. <laughs> I like the last part. I have to deal with you. You know what, Desmond? I don't even have time for this. I have work to do. So just call me back later. Bye. <laughs> No way. What do you mean no way? Listen, this guy took over my money. Are you just going to let him take all of it away? Just give me the ring, I'll get the money back. Look, I'll buy you double. This one. What do you mean this one? Are you just going to let me take all my money? Listen, this ring might just bring our money back. I have things under control. Believe me. This man, listen. Your hand had better be as good as you said. Dog is cheap. We have it. real of course it is I had it cleaned I'm told that extra clean diamonds can make a little difference hold on are you in any way saying that I must have brought you something that is not diamond you don't understand are you insinuating that I now roll with fake diamonds is that what you're implying emergency you remember the lyrics of the whole song that says every gambler knows the secret of surviving is knowing what to toss in and what to keep. Hey, 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 hey. I haven't come here for your sermons or preaching. You and your boys took away my money yesterday. Call them now. The game has just begun. I asked you about this, and you said you had it under control. And yes, I have it under control. How can you even say that to me? 
He just threw in my ring and lost. Temporarily, Zena. Lost temporarily. Listen, let's just assume today is one of those. You know, we have the good days, we have the bad days. Today is my bad day. I accept. But one thing I'll show you, I am going to get a lot of money and I will win everything back. This month, I do not care how you do this. My main concern right now is that I want my ring back. Trust me, Zina. Your ring, you will get back. Um, Miss Fiona, mm -hmm. you told us that your brother, Desmond, has gone for a very important uh, family business. Yes, I said so. Are you sure? I don't understand. Do you think my brother will be in town? And I'll tell you he traveled? But this one was the one I went out to answer his call. He was the one who called me equally. And what did he say? He said that he needs some money. The same thing he told me. That he needed some money and you have refused to provide it. That's what I've been battling since. This man is sick. He has no shame at all. And what has he been doing with the money wired to him every month? I think that's the question you're supposed to ask him. This man has decided to run our finances down. And I'm not going to let that happen. But the way he sounded, he really sounded as if he needs the yeah. money really fast. Of course. That's how we always sound. Please, can we stop talking about this month and just decide if we're changing our suppliers or retaining the old one? How may I help you? How much for this? Let me look at it. The band is 18 karat gold, but but, but what? <laughs> it didn't about the diamond is fake. So what is it worth? The gold weight is not much. I'm afraid. That's... That slimy little son of a bitch. What do you want to do? I think I have something I can give out no. for. Thank you, that's what I see. Thank you. You know, there's a secret code about life that many know but claim not to know. <laughs> all men are thieves and all women are prostitutes. <laughs> well, I know you will argue, but I can clearly tell you that a man who is not a thief will definitely steal when he sees the right amount in a conducive environment. Then a woman who is not a prostitute will surely bend for a stranger if the right amount is being given. In a secured environment. 
<laughs> you know, I work in a dairy shop where we melt and we design precious stones. Now, when the atmosphere is conducive, I can easily pick up the real thing and exchange it for the fake. <laughs> well, that is life for you. Anyways, um, I have to go now. I'll talk to you later. But I want you to know that I am that girl that will do anything, anything for money. Cheer up. I'm not running away. They're only just coming for a week. Yeah. A week? Mm -hmm. A week is like forever to me. Mm -hmm. What am I supposed to do all by myself that long? Mm -hmm. Babes, have fun. Yeah, have fun. Are you, are you for real? Are you serious right now? Yeah, um, baby. You haven't used your bill to buy visa yet, have you? Ah, uh, I believe that will keep you busy for the time I'll be with my family. A week in Dubai without you. How is that? Uh, sweetheart, you won't be shopping in, out, in, out that you, <laughs> you, you wouldn't even notice I'm, I'm not there with you. Okay, okay. I got you. I got you. <laughs> I know what to do to pull a smile on that face. Smile for me. All right. Let's see what we have here. Three million. Mm, I believe that will keep you busy for the week I'll be with my family, right? I guess it'll do. <laughs> so, why do I get a feeling that you're trying to get rid of me? Oh, come on with this, sir. Uh... Why haven't you divorced her yet? What do I know? She's over there all by herself. You visit once in three months, spend a week, and you're back here. He wouldn't know what she's up to over there. He wouldn't know what she's doing behind you. You need to end whatever it is you have with her. It's not real. You don't love her. Listen, baby. Don't I make you happier than she does? Mm. Baby, it's it that woman there. She is my wife. She's not just a girl. She's the mother of my kids. We've got kids together, so it's not that easy. Marriage devoid of love. 
You should stop whatever you have with her. You're just wasting your time. You're wasting your life with her. Oh, nothing to say. Sister, what do you want me to say? What do you just want me to say? We've been through all this countless number of times. <sighs> Come on, baby. Let this not just spoil our mood. Let this not spoil our mood. Whatever. I think I should let you go have all the time you need to prepare for your family. And also, wash away every trace of me. Babes, are we still seeing tonight? Assuming you have all the time and you're not busy with your family. Bye. Now, I want you to listen to this specific instruction I'm giving you. Locate Desmond wherever he is and teach him a lesson. You have my permission to rough handle him until he's left with a little life inside of him. Get back to me after you're done. never early to join me in my meditation class. Well, you just look for me. I heard that, you know. Come on, Nancy. Don't be a sneaky cat. And that is exactly what I'm talking about. You know, you lack presence of mind. And that is what I'm offering you on a platter of gold. And what's that? What else? Don't tell me what else. Mindfulness meditation. You know, it reduces fixation on negative emotions. It improves your focus and your memory. And it equally improves your relationship satisfaction. I will pass. I don't need it. Save it for those who need it. I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't want it. <sighs> so stubborn.
What happened to you? Huh? Why do you care? Of course I care. You are my brother. Oh. I am now your brother. Who did this to you? Hmm? What is the essence? You will use it against me. Do you know I can help you if you don't tell me anything? Who did this to you? Oh. Hmm? I owe some money. Ah, of course. Ah. Ah. Mm. Am I not right? I said it. I was expecting this expression. Well, I'm sorry. How much do you owe? Mm. Just 30 million naira. Just. What? <laughs> okay. I'm guessing you owe the money to Igedigu Abo. If I don't give him all of it by tomorrow, that man will kill me. Make 30 million naira available. Big brother, tell me. Why do you always get mixed up with this, this dangerous people? Huh? Tell me. What you wanted? Huh? You need to change your ways and start taking some responsibility. Take it now. You want the money, right? Take! You're behaving strangely. You are behaving strangely. But thank you, stars, that you're my sister. Thank you, stars, that you are my sister.
I'm so sorry, Ricky. Get down. Babes, I said I'm sorry. You're sorry? What exactly are you sorry for? Starving me of sex? Or making me feel less important? Come on, Ken. I am the one here with you. I satisfy you sexually. Emotionally and in any other ways. And who gets treated as a queen? Your, your bitch of a wife who is a thousand miles away from me. Tessa! Look, I take exception to this. I will not take it from you. Calling the mother of my children a bitch. I will not! Amazing! Oh, how? I... Mother of your kids, my foot! What does that make her? Hmm? An enigma? Ah! Come on, get me pregnant. Yes, sir. Do it! Get me pregnant! Get off me! Get off me! What is it? Have you gone crazy? Have you gone nuts? You wouldn't. Would you? Hmm? of millions to be made. <laughs> A couple of millions. <laughs> Gently tap them against the door. Then wait to be asked to come in. That's what normal people do. You knock! Come off it, girl. Knocking isn't what we are used to around here, is it? Too bad. Uh -huh. Um, babe. Yanni is on. Come, let's go. Let's go. Let's go listen. Yanni. Yoni, baby, how have you forgotten? The Greek artist. Oh, come on. We talked about it last time. The one my friend introduced me to. The music that cleanses the soul, Nikki. Come on, you need to join me, okay? Let's go. Come on, Nikki, you need soul cleansing. You need it. And I need you to leave. Please. Leave? Did I interrupt anything? My privacy! That's what? Oh, Nikki. You need soul cleansing. Listen, soul cleansing through music is better than meditation. Trust me. So you have to come with me. Please. No. Thank you. Maybe some other time. But you aren't busy. Nikki! Nikki! 
You and I know you were faking that sleep. Come on, Nikki, you need soul cleansing. Maybe I should leave the CD with you so you can play it when you are alone. Nikki! Trust me, you need soul cleansing. It's very good for you. You need soul cleansing. Soul cleansing. Oh my God. She talks too much. Ken, this attitude you're putting up is because I asked to be respected, huh? Tessa, I think you need to go home to clear your head off. I will talk to you later. Really? Ken. Hey! I didn't mean to interrupt you. I'm sorry about that. And I never knew you'd be coming home tonight. Well, I do not have plenty of scenes to film today, so 
I rather came back home instead of going to one of those cheap hotels of theirs to lodge. From here, I see. So, um, come join me. Yeah, you need soul cleansing. The vibes are good, and they are in abundance. Come. Oh, no, 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 not today. Come on, you will like it. Sweetie, I know the kind of things I like, and you cannot force me to start liking the things you like. So please, not today, okay? What is wrong with all of you? Oh, the girls are missing. Seen my brown LV bag? Is there any time you don't look for any of your luxury items? Sadly, no. And that's because I've got housemates who can't respect my privacy. For God's sake, this thing is simple. If you need something, ask for it. Most importantly, return the damn thing. I don't have your bag. At this point, I think I need a new apartment for myself. You can go. What are you waiting for? And I just might. Oh, enough of the arguments, guys. I'm hosting a soulfulness meeting at 12. And I want the atmosphere to be so pure for that. No way! You can bring those mental, demented people in here. Stop it! Mind your words, Nikki. I can host my meeting here. Tessa gave her permission, remember? Nancy, please. Have you seen my brown LV bag? Mm -mm. Easy. Oh. Just too noisy. Come on, um, Nick. 
Vicky! What is wrong with them? Um, Tess. Okay. I have no idea you're sleeping. I'm so sorry. Mm. Okay. Any chance you've seen my LV bag? Oh, um. Can I borrow it? Mm. Tess, please. There is a difference between borrow and stealing. You didn't borrow my bag. You stole it. You took it, Tess. What is wrong with you? Okay. 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 Thank you for the lesson. And so much. Ray. There. There. Tess, I really do not know what your problem is because you have enough. Enough of yours. Why are you always taking my things? And without my consent, why? Zena. Really? Are you freaking gonna buy me because of a freaking handbag? When you're living in my house rent free. Really? So now you want to make me feel guilty, Tess? No, you can't. You know why? Because I always offer my rent to you, but you wouldn't take it. So you can't make me feel guilty. Okay, now take your silly handbag out of my room. I need to see more. Get out. At this point, girl, you are just too foolish for my liking. Too, too foolish for my liking. And make sure you shut the door behind you. Already, Tess. Okay, right now I am. So will you pack your stuff out of my space now? Tess, you never objected earlier. I said I am doing that today, tomorrow, Tess. and forever. I do not want to see those things right here. No, 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 no. Ah. Tess, please, please, calm down. Oh, Tess. <sighs> It's only bad karma that can get you this agitated. Karma has finally caught up with you, right? Oh, Tess, you need help. Please let me offer you that. Please. Get your hands off me. Now. Tess. I said off! I do not want to see this! Stupid things! Put it right in my house! What is wrong with all of you? Why is everyone running mad at the same time? Ah! What do I do? What do I do now? And I have lots of people coming already. Oh. Do you need my 
my assistance in clearing those things. Oh, please. Don't even start. What's going on? She never objected to me having a class here earlier. Why now? Are you sure you don't need my assistance? Shush! is no. You can't have your class here. Take it to somewhere else, please. Yes, calm down. This is not why I am here. I've cancelled the classes already. I can pick up another venue, so that's not a bother. Tess, I'm worried about you. I mean, this is not you. Come on, talk to me. What is going on? One of those bad days. Of course. So, um, do you want to talk about it? Bad days are no more. They come and they go. This will also go. And please, when you don't scrutinize on me, shut the door behind you. Ah, and I say, mm -mm -mm. no, 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 no. I don't want your blessings shh, either. Shh. If you need someone to talk to, I'm always here for you, okay? Cheer up and smile. It's good for your soul. I'll be in my room. Such a handful. It's okay, it's, it's fine. Oh, better now that you called. Um, Papi, please. I just want to say, I'm sorry for being so unreasonable last night. Okay, um, I promise it won't happen again. Hello, Papi? Are you there? about her. I'm really worried. Nancy, can you just worry about yourself and leave Tessa alone? Did you see her reaction just now? Have you ever seen her like that before today? That's how powerful you are. You drive people crazy. 
You just drove Tessa crazy. With what exactly? Listen, Nikki, you don't even get it. This has nothing, absolutely nothing to do with me. Her soul is troubled. She needs soul cleansing. Hallelujah! And that's why we have you to take care of her, right? <laughs> oh, aren't you the master of soul cleansing? Please, please, allow me watch this movie in peace. Yo, girls, who's ready for mad ass fun today? Mm. you suddenly so in good spirit? I've got some couple of million of naira to spend on you girls today. So who's with me? Of course, of course I'm with you. Everything about me is with you. Um, should I give you my card so we hit the road? Nah, I'll take mine. But first, I'll go in there and refresh myself. Nancy, are you with me or not? Mm. Tess, you were agitated a few moments ago. What changed? She is in a fantastic mood now. That's what changed. Can't you see? Come on, girl. Go freshen up while I wait for you at the front door. Coming back soon. Okay. That was strange. How do you unlock the mystery of the universe? Even simple mood swing puzzles you. Excuse me. OMG. My goodness, this is so cute. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, this is lovely. I love it. Oh, Tess, kisses. Mwah. You're mm. too much, girl. <laughs> I personally chose those for you. Mm -hmm. Really? Nikki, you must be feeling more important than the person who actually paid for them. Oh, just shut up, girl. Tess, mm -hmm. trust me, this must be very very expensive. Mm -hmm. Now someone must be feeling so generous today. And that person happens to be my daddy. <laughs> um, Tess, I need you to find me a sugar that is just like your dad. What? <laughs> what did you just say? Would you put in a word for your friend? That's gross. Not her father. Nikki. Oh, just shut up. What do you know? Okay, girls, who's ready to show our Instagram fans what today look like? Me, of course. <laughs> Please tag me to the post. Definitely. Mm -hmm. So, Tess, you have to post every single thing, every single thing you do on Instagram. Well, I must be doing something extraordinarily right because I have 600,000 followers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, it takes an address to give you an edge. So what about me? Huh? I am an actress. You know, I had well over 15,000 followers. But what happened? The account was hacked by some hungry nonentities. Right now, I'm struggling to get about 10,000 followers or so. Engagements. Engagement, sweetheart, that is the answer. Your page has to be engaging and interesting. So, you're about now going live on Instagram in five seconds. Close with me. Okay. Nothing is hidden under the sun. Nothing is meant to last for a while and boom. Everybody knows, and you will bury your face in shame. Why would you make people?
people believe hey, Went on to places Everybody who's ready to listen to you What sort of human will keep on living a fake life? Yeah. There's no profit in living a fake life yeah, but not as great as it would have been with you, doll. Okay, so are you home? I see. <laughs> No, oh, hold on, Bobby. You did? Went on to taste everybody who's ready to listen to you. What sort of you I know, right? But I know you're doing all of this, so I'll not miss you, huh? There's no profit in living a fake life. Because I am so happy. Make sure you take care of yourself, okay? And also your family too. Boss, that's more than what you say, say to say. gotten my money or you've come to give me more stories all of it every last cent to see start to the rescue again. <laughs> Be sure to do something nice for her. She sounds like a good woman. It is my business and not yours. Well, I'm sorry we we had to roughen you up a little. Hmm? No hard feeling. Well, now that we are squared up, you can come back to the table. I would advise that you do not bet today. You know why? You will lose everything that you own. Uh -huh. We have to keep betting. We have to keep betting. Especially when you are committed. Come on, life is a game, isn't it? So they said. Shall we... Naked baby, the lady I wanted to see. Please sit. I've got some stuff for you. Really?
These are nice. Mm -hmm. I I want you to supply me with some zirconias. That is what I wanted to tell you. Neki, we need to be very careful. The whole street is hot. Police are everywhere. How do you mean? The other day, I got some of your fits. How? Who, who brought it in? Igudu Kwabo. What? How? how? How did it get to his hands? I guess someone gave it to him as a permit. Either way, let me inform you. That thing is in circulation. That is why we need to calm down and watch. So, so, how about this one? Nucky baby, I will take this for now. But like I said, we need to be very, very careful. Let us know this business for now. How do I, how do I survive? This is my only source of income. This is how I make money. <laughs> Nucky baby. Will I say that is your business? Or better still, you can go outside there and look for a buyer. <sighs> or you tighten up your belt for now. Or you leave off your salary. I will not do a But why did you tell Igduku Abo that it was fake? Nicky baby, you will not stop to admit. So I should pretend. So you want me to pay him with my hard earned money? Ah. Except I will cut that from your own money. Okay. Fine. Fine. All right. I better take my leave. All right, let me baby. Like I said, please be very careful. Yes, I will. Ah, <laughs> uh, baby. Mm -hmm. It's really good to have you here. Me too. Mm -hmm. I missed you too, my love. I know. You know, a whole week felt like one full year. Mm. Promise that you won't let me be all by myself again this long. Uh-huh. So much promise to make. Oh, come on, baby. You, you know my, my business is. Anything can come up. Yeah. Poor business. Takes a whole lot of blame in this days. Why? Why would you say that? Baby, business has never been a problem. It has not taken you so far, like, for days. 
If we did, you were always taking me alongside with you. And your point is? My point is that you're, you're, you're beginning to be so close to your so-called wife that you plan to spend more time with her. Uh-huh. That look on your face. That's guilt and you know it. Tessa. Tessa. You've suddenly become a nag and it's getting on my nerves. Yes. Okay. Point of correction. Quickly. I am not your wife, so I'm not a nag. Oh, yes. You can never be my wife because she's not a nag. She does not nag, so you can't be my wife. Yeah, go ahead. Walk away. That's all you do. Walk away. You don't talk about our problems. Our problems, you call it? No. Your problems. Tessa, I am sick and tired of talking about your problems. I've had enough. Yes, I'm a married man. What's wrong with being married? Does being married make me stop taking good care of you? Does it? Yes, sir. I don't wish to continue this anymore. It used to be fun, but not anymore. What do you mean? I cannot keep staying with a woman who makes me feel that having a family is a crime. No, I can't. You knew the deal before we started dating. Tessa, I am done. This is the last straw. Come on, Ken. Are you going to throw away everything we've had just like that? Yes, of course I will throw it away for my peace of mind. I will. Tessa, I'm sorry to say this to you. Can I have my car key back? It's very important. Okay. I said my car keys. Fast. This must be a silly joke. I am being serious. I say, can I have my car key back? Very important. I need my car back. Okay. Tessa, I'm not joking. I said, let me have my car key. Okay. 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 Why, why, why are you doing this? Uh, you know, what you're doing is not fair. Tess, what am I doing? What is it I'm doing? I've offered to drop you off. So what's wrong with it? Why? I mean, I drove down here. And I have to drive back home. Please. Your car is parked out there. Oh, sorry to tell you this. The car in question is also my car. I bought it, so I want it back. Yes. You can get, you can get that car for me. You cannot. The, the least you can do is to allow me to keep it. For all the things you've made me go through. You're a gold digger, Tess. You are a gold digger and you always be one. Let's not pretend that this is anything more than what it was. We were supposed to be a mutual agreement. But no. It's no more mutual. You bought me that car. Can, can you, 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 bought, you bought me that car and you cannot take it back. You will not Tess, take it back. Are you coming? Let me drop you off. I want to take a public transport home. Choose one. Can you give me back my car key? What, what, what do you expect of me? What, how, how do you want me to, to go about the, on the street without a car? A celebrity like me, what do you want people to say? Huh? Uh, it will not work. Uh, can you... Then get yourself a car. Can you give me my car key? Tess, are you coming or not? Why, why, why are you doing this? Come on, get up. Get up. Nothing is hidden under the sun Nothing is meant to last for a while And boom, everybody knows And you will bury your face in shame Why would you make people believe? Hey, went on to deceive Everybody who's ready to listen to you What sort of human will keep on living a fake life? Yeah, yeah. 
There's no profit in living a fake life. Would you prefer people to love you for who you are than the fake life? Yeah. There is nothing to gain when you live in the fake life. Nothing is hidden under the sun. Nothing is meant to last for a while. And boom, everybody knows. And you will bury your face in shame. Why would you make people believe? Hey, went on to deceive. Everybody who's ready to listen to you. What sort of human would keep on living a fake life? There's no profit in living a fake life. Would you prefer people to love you for who you are than the fake life? Yeah. There is nothing to gain when you live in a fake life. Take a look. Seems like someone had a bad day. I can't remember seeing her walking into this place. Same here. What's going on? Hey, girls. Were you robbed? You wish. Do I look robbed? How can you even say that? Unless you traded your precious car to something better. Oh, that. It developed electrical faults, so I stopped by at the mechanic to drop it. Oh, really? So. How did you get home? Tessa? Okay. Tess? 
are you sleeping? Yes. You're right. You know, I never knew you could hear people talk while you are asleep. You must be a genius. Tess. Tessa! You're right. Why did you dump me? Why did you dump me? And for who exactly? Someone that means nothing to me. of his money. Poppy. Poppy, I'm still standing here. Are you? Come on. Let's not start this sarcastic thing. Come on, Poppy, stop this. Stop it already. You know what you're doing to me is very unfair. 
You know it. Stop it, Tessa. Stop it. Enough. You know what? You should leave my office. Look, I haven't got enough time to waste on you. Did you hear me? Well, I am not leaving until you tell me what I want to hear. Quit trying, baby girl. I say quit. All right? Look, you and I are done. We are done. Okay? I don't know how else you want me to explain this to you. How else do you want me to tell you that we are done? Leave my office. I don't want to see you here again. Do not come around my office anymore. Did you hear me? Rubbish. Really? Just like that? I mean, you're willing to throw away everything we've shared? Just like that? Tessa, leave my office. I don't want to say it again. Well, I'll leave. But when this madness of yours is over, don't come looking for me because I won't be here waiting. Just I leave my office. Leave! Gosh, what can I remember these days? I'm sorry. Okay. This is getting too serious to be a game. Please, baby. A game of madness? I am mad, remember? And I've been praying that you'll still be available for me when my madness is over. Oh. I see. You're upset because I called you mad? Baby. I'm sorry. I'm truly sorry. I missed you. I missed you so much that I was almost going crazy. Tessa, look, I don't have time for this uh, drama uh, this early morning. As you can see, I'm about to go, and um, it's best of your interest you to join me, all right? Listen, baby. I'm sorry I disrespected your wife, and also, I asked you to leave her for me. I'm so sorry. Just that I want things to go back to the way it used to be. I promise. I won't complain again, okay? I won't. Ken, please. You're my life. I cannot be your life. I am not. You go find yourself another life because this life you see here, it's already taken. We are through, all right? Come on, Tessa. What exactly was your problem? What? I gave you the best of life. Not just the best, but a fabulous one for that matter. You drive your choice of cars. You lived in the best city of the town. You traveled anywhere. I put you through. Tessa, what more do you want? I made sure I gave you the best. Tessa, I got you movie roles. I paid you even when the producers refused to pay you. Tessa, I practically made you a star. I want you to be known. But what did I get for you? What did I get for you? You stole my peace. Now tell me, what right do you have to tell me to leave my wife? You even threatening to leave me if I don't. Who the hell are you? Who?
And what do you have to show for it? What appreciation do you have to show? You sleep around. And at the same time, you expect me to leave my family for you. I sleep around? Where is that coming from? Oh, come off it! Now tell me, unless Manafa is truly your younger brother. Of course. Manafa is my, my boyfriend. I, oh, come I, on, I mean, baby girl. I mean to say, he's mm, my mm, brother. Mm, which one is it? Manafa, it's your younger brother or your boyfriend? Which one? Which one is it? Oh, baby, please. Come on. You know, Manafa is my brother and, and you know it. Did you not have all that? Did you? Tessa, so I ask you again. It's Manafa, your younger brother, or your boyfriend? Do not stress it, my love, do not. Now listen to me. You are a beautiful young girl. You have a bright future ahead of you. Being with me doesn't stop you from planning your future. All right? Hence, I, I wasn't so inquisitive. Okay. It's not, it's not what you made of it. Okay. Listen, baby. I wasn't planning my future with Manafa. Okay. It's your love. It's you I want to spend my life with. It's you I want to be with. Please, baby. Tessa? Can you pick your bag and leave my office, please? And I mean it. Pick your bag, leave my office. Now. Don't you hear me? I say, pick your bag and leave my office. Sure, you've not experienced the wrath of a broken woman, have you? You will test it, again. I will serve you my wrath in full. You must have destroyed me. But you're going down with me. Oh, no way. Tessa, no way. Now leave my office. Leave my office. Thank you.
Hold it, hold it. That was the tip of the iceberg. I warned you, didn't I? I did. You will drink from my cup of fury for breaking my heart. Wait. Oh, wait until your precious wife hears about me. Really? Oh, really? How smart can you be? Now you listen to me, you little brat. Listen and listen very good. If I ever see you around these premises again, if I ever smell you around here again, this sir, you will see the other side, the sweetest side of Cain. I'm not yet done. You don't talk. We've not met before. I do not know you. You don't know me. But if you breathe one word about yourself to my wife or anyone else that she don't know about you and me, test her. I swear, this whole city, especially the ones you made to believe that you are from the famous Kennedy Lichuku family, will read your whole biography from A to Z on the billboard of this city. Do not dare me. <laughs> now tell me, what is it going to be? Protect your fake reputation or not? Answer me! You will stoop that low to punish me? I don't know of a great man of integrity that would cheat on his wife to begin with. Not this man you're looking at. No, because I'm different. Ironically, I cherish my wife and marriage so much that I would do just about anything to protect them. Did you hear me? Now do yourself a favor, you little brat, and be a good girl you are. Take a walk. Tessa, I say take a walk. I don't want to repeat myself again.
Is everything okay? Um, you, you say? Is everything okay? Oh, yes. Um, everything is fine. Bad news? Of course not. <laughs> everything is fine. Nothing really important, okay? Are you sure? Mm-hmm. Of course. It's not funny. I need about seven million naira right now. Exactly. The fact that I asked means that money is tight right now. For my rent, my landlord sends an overdue notices and I can't afford for him to send extra. Not anymore. Ken and I broke up. We broke up. Listen, Manafa. What you've done with me behind closed doors is not up to 20% of what Kane has done. So are you going to man up and send your girlfriend contribution, half, or something to add up to our rent or not? Manafa, you don't have $19,000. You have to do something very fast because I barely have two weeks. If not, I will be evicted. So, hello, Manafa. Hi, uh, <laughs> how are you? Feeling positive. You know, it's gonna be a bright day. Better days ahead. And with it comes positivity, good luck, etc. <laughs> really? Yes. You see, the moon has changed. Although it's gonna favor some people, and for some people, it's going to bring hardship. It's going to bring bad luck. And what have you? But not to worry. The positive energy that I bring into this home will protect us all. Mmm. <laughs> Tessa. Mm? Oh. 
Are you okay? Uh, of, of course I am. Um, you see, I'm trying to make a call right now, but it's not pulling through. It's not going through. I think it's not reachable or something. Please, can I use your mobile? I mean, your phone. Uh, please. My phone? Yes. Sure. Uh, yeah. Thank you. I'll be upstairs, okay? I need to take a shower. Oh, sure. Um, password. Oh. Password. <laughs> Don't look. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Here. Thank you. I'll be upstairs. Sure. That bastard must have blocked my number. Hi. It's, it's Tessa. be a way out. There is a way out. Or should I go back to my Ron's business? No, I cannot. For you, I thought they're after you. Come on, I am too smart. They can't get me. I hope so. Um, why 
pushy here? I mean the girl who just left your shop. So you now want to know everything that comes in here and out? That girl, it's my housemate. I am serious. She's my housemate. If you must know. She brought this. Are you serious? That girl is very rich. So why would she want to sell these things? What, what does she what does she need the money for? <laughs> <laughs> Necky baby. Now let me tell you. You can only be great in this business when you know how to read people. That girl is not rich. She was desperate not to have care. They won't. I'm just... Anyway, it's that bad way. What's that? Did oh no, me? not now. The street is so hot. Police are everywhere. I don't even know who gave them information about what is happening here. So, just keep it. We can do this business some other time. But there's no... I, I need money. There's no police anywhere. Just keep it, baby. Whoa, I... Whoa, I... Rastaman. He's addicted. He's addicted and this chronic. Sadei. Nothing can save him unless the grace of Jah Almighty. Oh, I, he is addicted. He's addicted and this chronic. I said, nothing can save him unless the grace of Jah Almighty. A rocket man, boom, cause the power of obsession, I, has taken over him. Sadei, the power of obsession, I has captured this spirit. Sai, the power of obsession, I has taken over him. The power of obsession can never set him free. Oh, I, the power of a bad habit is like a full of fire. Can never be put off at all. I, it can only burn and save out. I, cause it's a consuming fire. I, cause the power of obsession. I, has taken over him. Sadei, the power of obsession. I, has captured this spirit. Sai, the power of obsession. I, has taken over him. Power of obsession can never set him free. Oh, I, he's addicted, he's addicted, and this chronic. Sadei, nothing can save him unless the grace of Jah Almighty. Oh, I, he is addicted, he's addicted, and this chronic. I said, nothing can save him unless the grace of Jah Almighty. A rocket man, boom, cause the power of obsession, I has taken over him. Said, the power of obsession, I has captured this spirit. Say, the power of obsession, I has taken over him. The power of obsession can never set him free. Oh, I, the power of a bad habit is like a full of fire. Can never be put off at all. I, it can only burn and save out. I, cause it's a consuming fire. I, cause the power of obsession, I, has taken over him. Sadei, 
The power of obsession I has captured the spirit Sai The power of obsession I has taken over him The power of obsession Can never set him free Oh I Your account officer is on the line and she sounded really urgent. Yes, this is Fiona. Is there anything I can do for you? What? Is he still there? Thank you very much for letting me know. Thank you. Have a look. Wow. You native vegetable sauce. Mm. 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 You like mm. it? Mm. Yummy. <laughs> Christmas came early this year. <laughs> I knew you weren't going to forgive me if I hadn't gotten some for you. You bet I wouldn't. <laughs> How? Oh. I will be having a dinner meeting with some friends today. Would you like to go with me? No. Uh, no. Maybe some other time. Okay. Mm -hmm. Were you at a pawn shop today? Say, oh, a pawn shop. Um, I, I saw you. Oh, you did. I, I I popped in there to drop some items for a friend. A friend? Uh, yeah, actually, he got cheap gifts. Item he needed to discard, so he asked me to get rid of them. Okay, if you say so. Um, I have to get going now. I'll see you again. Uh -huh. Enjoy your meal. Mm -hmm. right. Is there any way in this city this bitch girl doesn't go? Ah. Hey, 
show. Oh, still filming. Like my life revolves around filming. Well, Tessa here is going to blissful boutique to pick up a few things. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. So I can rush, go change, and then um, follow you to blissful boutique. Well, unfortunately, this is no girl shopping spree. <laughs> so I'm gonna go. Mm, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I've never heard you complain about being broke. Oh wow, get lost, girl. Tessa never gets. Nothing is hidden under the sun Nothing is meant to last for a while And boom, everybody knows And you will bury your face in shame Why would you make people believe? Hey, went on to deceive Everybody who's ready to listen to you What sort of human will keep on living a fake life? There's no profit in living a fake life oh, Would you prefer people to love you for who you are Than the fake life, yeah There is nothing to gain when you live in a fake life oh, Nothing is hidden under the sun Nothing is meant to last for a while and Everybody knows, and you will bury your face in shame. Why would you make people believe? And went on to see everybody who's ready to listen to you. What sort of human will keep on living a What's fake going on? life? Yeah. There's no profit in living a fake life. Oh. Cool. It's fine, I'll meet you there in an hour. There is nothing to get when you live in the fake life. Burning down the house today. You don't need to be spiritual to know what an incense is, Zena. Have you seen my designer jacket today? The one Tessa wore to Blissful Boutique? No, she didn't. I don't know. Maybe both of you have the same kind of designer jacket then. Fuck that bitch. You can't swear in my room, Zena. Fuck off, girl. <laughs>
this here. Like, is this all you've got? No. Let me show you Ah, oh, I'm exhausted already. I've been walking around here. I'm sorry. You see the ones who like this. If you don't like it, then you can go. But I'll show you. They are fine clothes there. Let's go. Okay. After you. All right. Jacket. Oh, that. Discard it. It's old. Which is this old jacket? I just made the payment to you. 200,000 naira, sir. I'm sorry, sir. Do you know I've never owed you? Just things are a bit difficult right now. Things are tough for me. Please, sir. Sir, so one week will not be enough. Please, sir, uh, just... I know, I know, I know. Just a few more weeks, I'll, I'll raise something. Hello? Hello? Thank you. 
What's the problem? They try to smell green. I don't understand. Try again. The Excuse me, sir. I just used this card outside. So you cannot tell me my card is not working. Okay? I just made use of it. Sorry, ma'am. Sorry, 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 sorry. Please come. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Just let me let me attend to you and then know what to do about it. Please, please first. Sorry, sir, for delaying. One server, sir. This is embarrassing, really, because I just used this card. Maybe it's on your eighteen first. Um. Uh, thank uh, you, sir. You're welcome. Okay. Um. I'll just go outside, use the bank, and come back. No problem. Thank you, ma'am. I got myself an old jacket from Blissful Boutique. I'm sorry, Zain. You're sorry? Tessa, you're sorry? You took my belonging without my consent. And you sit your ass down here to tell me you're sorry. Like I'm supposed to be clapping for you. What is wrong with you, girl? You even have the guts to discard it there. Zain, I did not. I... I was in a hurry. No, you weren't. I was there, Tessa. I saw you. You did not see me. <laughs> you called it old and trashed it there. Tessa, if you hate my jacket so much, why did you even borrow it at first? Did you borrow it? You took it, girl. You did. For God's sake, you have plenty of yours. I don't know. I didn't just feel like taking it around. I'm sorry, Zane. I'm sorry. You're such a spoilt little brat. That's what you are. I have to pay another 8K just to rebuy my old jacket. Oh, you did not. Oh, yes, I did. So cough it out. <sighs> Come on, girlfriend. I will, but this is not the right time. This is not a good time for me. Okay? Please. Come on, Zane. Two of us relate. 
Say you didn't hear me. I beg. God, I beg. No, let your picking go back village. I beg. I won't take face the people for village. How will I face the world? Ah! That's our conquer. The girls. Oh. How will they look at me when they realize? I mean, nobody like them. Tessa. Mm. Mm. Hey. Tessa. Your own is finished. some of the things she bought through the time. I don't know how long I can keep her here. But I'll try. All right, thank you. Okay, sir. I'm so sorry, ma. I had to take that call. Okay, I, I want to return the clothes. I really don't understand. You tried all these on before you took them out. It doesn't fit anymore. Moreover, your policy says I can return them after seven days. In my case, it's just three days. So please. Okay. Do you have the card you used originally? And what do you need it for? I need to return the money back to it. That's a short policy. Oh, mm, well, I don't have the exact card with me, but I can make do with cash. I wish I could. I don't have enough cash. The register. Do you like the card at all? Or what? Um, I'll be back, okay? <laughs> I'm sorry, ma. You can't leave. The police are on your way. What, what, what do you mean? My friend, leave me. <laughs> you shop with us with a stolen card, and, and the police have been looking for you. So I, oh, I'm oh, afraid oh. That I, I, I need to turn you in because I've been, I've been in trouble. Excuse me, you're harassing me, okay? You need to wait. Do you know I'm celebrating? Okay. What, what, what? The police are useless. They can't even attend to emergency. Bad system. I lost the Bad system. Tessa would be among those who would experience the negative side of the change. And what change are you talking about? Okay, let me explain. 
the moon changed its position few weeks back. And this can affect people either positively or negatively. Nancy, why do you always sound weird? But this is not a joke! I'm serious! Please, just stop. I'll get the damn door. Nikki, come on, you have to believe me. I think Tessa is in some kind of hardship. We need to help her. But we don't even know exactly what her problem is. That is the problem. Nobody knows what her problem is. Perhaps that's exactly what we're about to find out. The agent guy who delivered this to me said it's an eviction letter from the landlord. What? Go away. Tess, why do you want me to go away? We have an eviction letter. Tess. Tess, what's going on? Nothing. No, absolutely. Nothing, and yet they gave us an eviction notice. Tess, come on. You know you can talk to me. Tess, listen. You can trust me more than you can even trust yourself. You know that. I'll take care of it. I'll sort it out, trust me. Says, do you owe him money? You forgot to pay him, right? Tess. I really do not know what's going on. But let's just wait and see. Yes, you are. What did she say? Huh? I said, what did she say? Do I need to get myself a new place to live? Come on, Nancy. Don't keep us in suspense. What did Tessa say about the eviction later? No, nothing. Girl, can you please spit it out already? I heard you guys having a conversation in there a while ago. Just calm down, okay? Calm down. Everything will be fine. Nancy, we just received an eviction letter. You remember? Listen, I spoke to Tessa, all right? She said there must be a mix-up somewhere. She said she'll call the landlord so that they can... Sort it out. Just that? A mistake? Nancy, are you even listening to yourself talk right now? An eviction letter has been issued to us, and you expect me to believe it's just a mistake? How? Nancy! I don't get it. So this man has been paying your rent for what? Five years? 
and now he has dumped you and he has refused to give you money. <sighs> but come on, girl. You are from the renowned Ekene Dilichuku family. So you should have your own money. I am not, Nancy. I am not from the renowned Ekene Dilichuku's family. I'm not even related in any capacity. I'm just a girl who has a sugar daddy. <sighs> okay, wait. If you are not from the Ekene Delichuku family, then who are you? Teresa Okonkwa. Teresa Okonkwa. A young girl who is trying to belong by all means. Oh. Three, three hundred. <sighs> 
About what? Downstairs now, please. We need to talk. It's important. <sighs> okay. I'll join you soon. Fine. What sort of human would keep on living a fake life? Yeah. There's no profit in living a fake life. Oh, oh. Would you prefer people to love you for who you are than the fake life? Yeah. There is nothing to gain when you live in the fake life. Oh. Nothing is hidden under the sun. Nothing is meant to last for a while. And this is not fair. Firstly, they cut off our light and now the water is no longer running. What's going on, Tess? Nothing. An eviction letter was issued to us. You called it a mistake. And now, we've lost all our utilities. Explain, Tessa, what's going on. Come on, girls. This is my house. Everything is under control. Clearly. Tessa, please, can you just give it up already? What is going on? Tell us. We are eager to know. Can you just tell us what's going on or you just want to keep acting like a child? Look. I can get myself a very comfortable place to be. But I think it's time you say it the way it is. Stop acting like this. Be honest for once in your life. Calm down, girl. Calm down. Tess. Tell them. Tessa. Listen, girl, you can't keep this secret any longer. Come on. Oh, please shut up. Shut up, Nancy. Oh, please be done with the lies, Tessa. What is wrong with you? Don't you understand that lying consumes the soul? You need, you, you need to free your spirit. You have to tell them yourself. I can't do the talking for you. Are you 
trying to tell us that you are not rich? Why am I not surprised? I don't think Okonkwo had anything to do with the renowned Ekene Delichuku family of Nehru. Shenyu? I had my inkling. You're not modest at all. I don't understand why you would hide your real identity. Just last week, I was able to know your real name. Oh my God. I have been misled. How could you hoodwink us like that? Hey, just drop it. This is not the worst thing anyone can do. There is no scent in here. Oh, is there? Well, I wasn't having an affair with a married man. Well, we will come back to you. But for now, let's talk about me. What if I told you that I have never sold a pin online before? What if I tell you that I do not have any online store? Not with Jumia or Conga. Hey! But you always do deliveries. So I made it seem. Well, breaking news. I am a pusher. Hey! A freaking dope pendler. That's who I am. Hold on. It's not true, Zina. Zina, you are joking. Hey! A pusher? Girls, look. It's not like I'm in love with what I do. I don't like it one bit. It's risky. I've almost been killed a bunch of times. Right? I'm just doing all of those things to secure a good life for me and my kids. So they don't get to hustle the way I'm hustling right now. That's all. I'm sure you have something to tell us as well. Well, since everyone is coming out clean, please, 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 fingers crossed. Please, don't tell me you don't work at the jewelry shop. Please don't say that. I do work at the jewelry store. Oh. I mean, I did work at a jewelry store before I quit. Huh? That's not my source of income. Oh, wow. I still reel diamonds and sell them. Yay! I knew it! My ring! My diamond! Damn it! Damn it! That's how I've been making my money till my boss started suspecting. I had to quit the job. He would have come to arrest me just that I gave him uh, a wrong address. Oh, you would have rot in jail. To cut the long story short, I'm a thief. Yay! Now, mm -hmm. oh, wow. So, three out already. One more to go. Uh -uh. What 
is it now? I'm not a bad person. You all can testify to that. I have never done anything bad in my entire life. I have absolutely nothing to hide. Nothing. I've lived a true life. Drama queen herself. Perhaps one of us needs more time. Mark my words. You're suppressing so many ugly shades in them. And one day, they will all come spilling out when you least expect it. You wish. Listen, girls. I am not a bad person. I mean, you all can testify to that. Okay, girls. Enough of the confession. Let's come back to reality. Now that there's no Ekene Delechuku or a big god to pay our rent, what do we do? Well, from what I gathered, the rent is three million naira. Yes. And I've been able to raise 500,000 naira. All right, girls. We will sort the rest out. All, most of it. Understand? Yes, that's fine. Why are you guys doing this? After all I've put you through, you still want to help me like this? Tessa, in as much as you've been lying to us, you've been such an amazing person. You've been so good to us. Mm -hmm. You know what? Come here. Come. You need a hog. Okay? You need a hog. It will help cleanse your soul. Mm -hmm. Come on. Get up. Okay. Well, I don't know about you girls, but it's actually a fun day for me because we're able to leak out our little secrets. And most importantly, we need to safeguard this secret of ours. Alright, so we have to vow that we'll keep it till we die. <laughs> Deal? Yes. Nancy, what's going on? Mm? Nancy. Nancy. Mm? <laughs> Desmond. You brought a gun to my house? Hmm? Can I have my money? You know what? I don't even have time for this. What are you doing? You're on inch. I'm calling the people that can help you. Put the phone down. Smart. 
If I give you this money, you will squander it. You will be dead in the months. I promised mom and dad I was going to look out for you. My own company. Company you know I am supposed to own. As if you wanted any responsibility that came with it. What are you talking about? You took my bed right. I took nothing from you. Everything from no, me. No, I took nothing from you. You had no interest in running the family businesses. You never wanted to work for a living. All you wanted was just money, 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 money. That's all you talk about. You wanted to live a life of luxury. You know, I, I, I wish I'd gotten the free, free will like you do. But no, I can't. Because somebody had to work. Somebody had to handle the, the, the family business. You should be grateful. You should be happy that I'm helping you out. I'm sitting where you're supposed to be sitting. And you stand there and tell me that you deserve more. You should be ashamed of yourself, person. You should be ashamed of yourself. Look at you. <laughs> That's what you do. Of course. Like you ever give me a trial? Like you, mother, father ever believed in me? You never believed in yourself. Then how can I believe in you? Tell me, how? Give me my money. And I'm your younger sister. I will always look out for you. Sign your inheritance off to you, but only on one condition. What stupid condition is that? Listen, I don't have that time. Get me the documents, let me sign. You will sign another document relinquishing your position as a member of the board. Is that it? Mm -hmm. This is why you're wasting my time. The same member of the board that you guys have evicted me a long time. The same one you manipulated, the same one you took all to yourself. Listen, I don't have that time. Get me the documents, let me sign. To a better future, girls. To a better future. <laughs> Tonight, let's drink and get high. <laughs> Listen, girls, we have tomorrow and the rest of our lives to worry. Mm. And trust me, things will certainly get better mm. if we stick together. Mm -hmm. That is for sure. That's right. That's right. Sure. That's right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um. That guy is really enjoying himself. I know that guy. He's an emergency. Really? How do you know him? He's a customer. No way. I thought the emergencies are a bunch of responsible people. Nah, 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 nah. Not this one. 
He is so full of himself. He is the brokest rich guy I have ever met. Plus, he is a badass gambler. Probably he got himself some cash. Oh. I think he's coming this way. Really? Yeah. Uh, what do we have here? Hey, Vince. How are you, Zena? I'm doing well. And you? I am fine. I see you have some beautiful ivory ice creams around. You know I love ivory ice cream. Right. So, will you be kind enough to introduce each and every one of them today? Not a big deal. Okay, this is Nikki, Tessa, and Nancy. Girls, meet my friend, Desmond. Hi, Desmond. Hi, Desmond. Nancy, come and say hi to my friend. Hi. Uh, hi, everyone. I must say you all have something in common aside the beauty. I see you have something for ivory ice cream, just like I do. <laughs> so today happens to be a day I have decided to celebrate, to burn some cash because I am fully loaded. So, without wasting much of your beautiful time, can I upgrade this table by us moving to the VIP lounge? What would you say? Well, Dennis, I'm sure we're doing great here. So, thanks. But you can join us if you don't mind. Uh, um, Zina, I see three bottles on your table. So, what you call great? You're doing great here. Yeah, of course not. Um, let us move to the VIP. Let me spoil you all. Oh, Desmond, it will be an honor to have you amongst us. Mm -hmm. A gentleman like you to be in our midst. <laughs> like I said this morning, we are doing great. All right. She just called me a gentleman. I'd rather act like one. Okay. <laughs> I like to sit in the front of the front. Middle. You already know it is very sweet in the middle. Huh? <laughs> You will never change that small. As long as there are beautiful cookies, beautiful ivory ice cream, change is nowhere to be found. Waiter! What he said, girls. Mm -hmm. But did you take him serious? He was dead drunk when he made those claims last night. Exactly. He was drunk. Haven't you heard the saying that in wine there is truth? Oh. It's not a secret to me. The Umejesis are what they are stinkingly rich. 
So are you trying to say that we should steal their inheritance? I wouldn't use the word steal. Girls, this guy came when we needed help. He came at the right time. I think we should just make use of this opportunity. Yes. We should just see this guy as a prayer and sad. Where is Nancy? Teaching class. Girls, look, I don't know about the both of you, but me, I do not want to be a dope peddler for the rest of my life. No. Okay. I'm not against stealing. Hmm? It's not like I've not stolen before. I'm going to get Nancy on board. She wouldn't pass up a night to feel her guru's comfort. Hold on. First of all, what's your plan? Um, I'm going to figure it out soon and get back to you. But first off, I need you to continue with whatever dirty shit you've started with him already in the room. That way we can keep him so close. Girls, this guy is an easy meat that we need to devour. Okay. So girls, you have to go on. Do whatever you can to keep him here. We don't want him in the street where some hungry girls will strip him up before we get a chance. Do you understand? Yeah, we got a plan. Okay. I'll figure something else and get back to you as soon as possible. All right. Can I go back to my room? Of course. Sure. <laughs> Sounds fun, right? Um, <clears throat> so, um, for how long is it going to be here for the weeks? Just a little bit of time. Oh, shut up. Oh. Stop it. No, I'm not. No, I want you to take your bag and make you spill up this bag in that. Stop, stop it. Hey, this. I got you, baby. Thank you, more. me to explain it again. I will. But the truth is, someone else is messing up, not me. Really? Yes. Can I have a moment with you? Okay. So what's up? How would you feel? to lay your hands on Desmond Umejisu's fortune. I don't get, I, I thought the sister controls that. She did, but not anymore. Oh. So, I'm listening. She has given him his entire inheritance. And that's why you saw Desmond clubbing and celebrating. Oh, I see. Okay. This man has been at my apartment, clubbing nonstop, getting stoned, staying all up, no end. Let me guess. 
Desmond is throwing around all his money. And you girls want to get a hold of the rest of it. Perfectly. Listen, sooner or later, he is going to blow away everything he's got. And if we don't have it, someone else will. Okay. So I guess you already have something figured out. So where do I come in? I don't want it to be said that I am teaching you anything. Odogu Igidiku Abo. You are the master. Yes. The master that works with information. The master that listens to his subjects. So what have you gotten planned? Well, as a chronic gambler, he's got all the money in the world to play. But if he finds out that someone stole from him, we are all going to go down with him. So here is what I want you to do. I want you to stage it. Stage it in a way that he's not going to find out anything. Make him lose everything without blaming anyone but himself. <laughs> Desmond hardly comes to the board nowadays. So how am I going to get him to do that? I can make him come. But first off, you have to promise me that you will milk him. Now listen, I make my money by manipulating cards. Now, if you promise me that the Jezebel in you will get him back to the board, then I might be able to do something. In that case, we've got a deal. Listen, from what I know, gambling is meant for the money bags. The wheel rotates. The problem is, the poor gets broke before it rotates back to them. But the money bags will always be there. Because when the demon rotates, it still makes them there with money. Well, the way you analyze these things, it feels like you are a professional. Oh, come on. You know I'm a street girl. I, I know these things. I am in. That's good. He's a bit than this chronic. Sadei, nothing can save him. Unless the grace of Jah Almighty. Oh, I, he is a big day. He's addicted and he's chronic. I sabe nothing can save him unless the grace hello? of Jah Almighty. Yes, hello. It's me, Desmond. Um, yes, I am ready. I am coming with a whole lot of bucks. I hope you are coming with the same. Desmond, you know I'm ready for you whenever you are. You know, I like the move you make, and I know this time around. You're going to kill me. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. Talk is cheap. I always tell you. You give me time. In fact, give me an appointment and I will meet you there. Okay, whatever you want. 7 p.m. tomorrow. Okay? So be it. Because it's a consuming fire. Because the power of obsession. He wants to pick the dealer. <laughs> Something tells him that the trick is in the card. <laughs> we'll see tomorrow, this one. The power of obsession has taken over him. The power of obsession. So, the strong man of our book. The, the strongest man. Ah. <laughs> oh, you came with some friends. Aren't you going to introduce them? Point of correction. I came with beautiful ivory ice cream. That's <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I'll start with this beautiful one here. Mm -hmm. Her name is Nancy. Okay. 
<laughs> you see the way I pronounce yeah, it. Yeah, That's yeah. how you know how beautiful. Yeah. Nancy. Yeah. <laughs> and then, look at the one in the middle with the luscious lips. Luscious lips. <laughs> Trip, drop. Her name is Tessa. Oh. <laughs> Tessa. Yes. And then look at the last one. <laughs> with the cat eyes. Mm. And look at her. <laughs> uh, uh, with the, with the, with the, with the. <laughs> her name is Nikki. Oh, you see how I pronounced it? Yeah. Nikki. Lovely, lovely, ah. lovely. These are my short names. So, beautiful ah. ivories. Yes. This is the strong man of our ball. Mm. <laughs> Hi. 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 A wonderful matured lady. Ah, uh, um, mm, 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 man from our boy, I congratulate you. Okay. Beautiful ivory ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> All right. B I I. Beautiful. B I I. Wow. <laughs> Beautiful ivory ice cream. Beautiful ivory ice cream. Yeah. I love that. We're matured ladies. Uh, we yeah. keep having problems. <laughs> Address them. Okay. It takes uh, the B I I. Yeah. To come to the mashot table with mashot man. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Yeah. Of course. Oh. So, but, 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 but you look familiar. Uh, I don't, I don't I see you somewhere. Oh, no, I don't think so. She's an actress. Wow. <laughs> and as you know, they don't walk around unless heavily paid. Oh, oh, oh yeah! I so remember pretty. you now. Yeah, 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 yeah. I remember you on TV. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the car dealership commercial, right? Exactly. Yeah. Oh, pretty! I'm good with faces. <laughs> well, I'm good with games, mm. Mister. We haven't come here for all that. Can we just stop all this TV commercials? Good with faces, and get down to business, huh? Okay. Why are you such a terrible shit? Why are you calling me names? Do not rush him, Diku. He doesn't know where he's coming from. He knows exactly where you're coming from. Even if you decide to set up a fraudulent structure, am I not supposed to win some and lose some? Why am I losing everything? You are losing because you're not playing with any atom of professionalism. Now, if you get off your high horse and be humble, you now probably might teach you how to win a hand or two. Okay? But we are not here to teach anybody. And perhaps, Tibu can turn around and Desmond will win everything right back. Exactly. A gambler cannot be frugal in spending. You never know. Your fortune might be in the last game. And until you play the last game, you will never know if you get that fortune. Speak! I just told you back there that I'll teach you how to win. And why are you putting a gun on my head? Hmm? A man that has lost everything has no conscience, so you shut up! You guys set me up! I need you to explain to me what happened back there! Look, look, I don't know what you are talking about. We gambled and you lost. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. Uh, oh, really? Oh, really? Ten seconds! Ten! Nine! Hey! Oh, 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 okay, 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 okay. All, all right, all right, get gone off my head. Look, uh, 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 look, I'll tell you everything. Look, Zina set this up, okay? Uh, and the boss manipulated everything. Okay, that's it, that's it, that's it, okay? Uh, uh, all right? Oh God, I'm so tired. Are you hungry? Are you? I'm just tired. Are you expecting someone? No. 
No. Who could that be? I'm not respecting anybody. Sit down. Who? Waitress! Who? Open the door, waitress! That's him! Don't let him in. Hold on, girls. There's a no! If you don't open the door right now, it is going to look suspicious. Let, let me just go open it before he brings it down, okay? No, 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 please. I, I, I can't be here, no, no. Lost it, remember? I am not playing games with you. Where is my money? Please, I have no idea what you're talking about. Of course, you know what I am talking about. You lied to me. You deceived me. You connived with that card bastard, Anigiri Buabo. You did, right? Where is my money? Please put the gun down. We can trash this out. We can fix this. Give it to me. Tell me why you get my money. One, two, three, four. Oh. Jesus. Jesus. Huh? Eh? We can't let the police come here searching and, and find this body here. We, we just have to get rid of it. He's dead already. Sit down. We need to get rid of his body. Ah! Ah! Nancy! Are you serious right you, now? Why are you? Oh my god. Nancy! What's this all you're doing? We have a serious issue at hand, Nancy! of Jal Almighty, oh I, he is addicted, he's addicted and he's chronic, I, Sade, nothing can save him, unless the grace of Jal Almighty, I rock it man, cause the power of obsession, power of obsession. has taken over him, Sade, the power of obsession, I, Captured the spirit, say the power of obsession. I has taken over him. The power of obsession can never set him free. Oh, I, the power of a bad habit is like a fire, can never be put off at all. I, it can only burn me, save out. I, cause it. Say consume and fire your eye Cause the power of obsession I Has taken over him Sade The power of obsession I Has captured the spirit Say The power of obsession I Has taken over him The power of obsession I can 
ever set him free. Oh, I. He's addicted. He's addicted and he's chronic. Sabe, nothing can save him unless the grace of Jah Almighty. Oh, I. He is addicted. He's addicted and he's chronic. I. Sabe, nothing can save him. Unless the grace of Jah Almighty, I rock it, man. Cause the power of obsession. Mr. Mendes, there is a police detective here. He wants to see you. Police detective? Yes, sir. Okay, send him in. Good afternoon, Mr. Majesty. Yes, good afternoon. May I sit down? Yes, please do. Thank you. How may I help you? It's about your brother. Sir. This month. What does it understand? There's no easy way to go about this, but. Your brother, this month, mm. was found dead earlier today. What? Yes. I know. Come on. Uh, no, it's my brother. Dead? Yes. <sighs> Tell me you're joking. See, relax your mind with him, please. Um, when was the last time you saw him? About a week ago. A week ago? Yes. We got into a heated argument. I gave him all of his inheritance and I told him, I, I, I told him never to show his face around me again. Huh? So, do you know where he was staying before now? No. My brother, my brother lived all his life in hotels. Do you know anybody or group of people that he might have problem or fracas with? Mm. I think yes. It was it was owing money to to what he did go for but yes, he did go for but The same Igidupo of Abba was shot dead this morning. I hope you don't think my brother has anything to do with it. Not definitely, not definitely. Please don't go there. You see, we admit that your brother is already dead for two days now. Someone somewhere killed with the poor father. But his gang is not saying anything about it. My brother might not have done it himself. But do you do you think that it has something to do with, with him? It's too early to say, Mr. Majesty. It could be a coincidence, you know. But knowing that he had a problem with the poor father. It's a lead way to help us in this investigation. Yes. I just knew it. I knew that as soon as I gave him all of his inheritance, this was going to be a matter of time. My brother, my brother was self-destructive. What about the reward? That might get people talking. Because nobody is talking right now. Okay. But just make sure that you find my brother's killers. We will do everything possible 
that prevent all the wisdom of these deaths. I promise you that. Well, for now I will, I will take my leave. Zina! But this is not your number. I had to discard my sin, so I wouldn't leave any traces. Listen, I'm in serious trouble and I need you to do something for me. What is it? Ikidikuabo is dead and his men are after me. <gasps> Zina, you killed him. I had no choice. He was going to keep our money. Where are you now? I left town. I'm being chased by the police and Ikidikwa was men. Lagos is no longer safe for me. In case anything should happen to me, I stashed the money. <sighs> this is not this is not good, Zina. Honestly, this is not good. This is not good. Everything is turning upside down. Everything is against us right now. No, it isn't. Not if I can count on you to do something for me. I would have called any of the other girls, but since they've stolen from me before, I can't really trust either of them. So what do you want me to do? I am going to test you an address just out of town. Go there alone and collect our money. Can you do that? Okay, okay, okay. It's by that uncompleted building beside the senator's house by housing estate. Go there. Pick the money. I am going to text you exactly on how to locate the money back. Okay. I got it. Once you pick the money, drive back to the apartment. Pick Tessa and Nikki. Drive towards the Abuja Road. I will test you an address when I get there. Meet me up there and we will travel out of the country together. You got that? Zina, Zina, I am scared. I'm scared, Zina. We, we, we've done a lot of bad things. Zina, we don't even have protection. Zina, I'm scared. I'm scared. <gasps> Karma has finally caught up with us. It has. Nancy, we create our luck in life. Now you stay calm and do exactly as I've said. Do you understand? I just don't want anything bad to happen to us. I know you don't. It's gonna be fine. See you in a day or two. Okay, bye, Zina. Bye. Oh. Listen, there's something I need to do, okay? That sounds mysterious. Just forget it. Do me a favor. Get hold of Tessa anyhow you can do it. Tell her to come home immediately. Please. Why? Just forget it. I'll explain when I come back, okay? Call her. Tell her to come home immediately. Okay. Oh, okay. shh. Thank you. 
come back. What is wrong with her? And where is she rushing off to? Hi, Tessa. Um, listen, you need to come home immediately. I don't know. Nancy said you should come home as soon as possible. Are you coming? You need to come right away. Okay, okay, see you soon. Bye. <laughs> Nancy. I, I don't know. She asked us to wait for her. I, I really, I will. I got here and she's not here. Okay. What, where did Zina go to? I've not, um, I've not heard from her since she left the house this morning. Yes. I just finished the press conference. And I'm aware that the video has already gone viral. This is a trying times for me and my family. Do the journalists to respect the privacy of my family as we mourn Desmond? Yes, I offered one hundred million naira to anyone who will provide information that will lead to the arrest of of his killers. Yeah. Oh my God. I need to call my sister right away. That's true, that's true. I need to call, I need to call Zina. What is going on? God. 
pick up your phone. What's going on? She's not picking. I think something is wrong. Either her phone is switched off or it's not reachable. Now keep trying. You know what? Keep trying, Nancy. Why I keep calling saying, okay? Nancy, Nancy, Nancy. What is happening? Nancy, are you back home now? Thank goodness. Nancy, you don't have an idea how many times I've been trying to reach you, but your number is not going through. Nikki has been trying to get to Zena, but straight to voicemail. What's going on? I spoke with Zena earlier. She's not with her phone. Okay. Okay. Notwithstanding, Nancy, you have to come back home right away. Now. What is it? Listen. Promise me you won't freak out. Just tell me, what is it? Okay, listen. The police found Desmond's body. The news is everywhere. Every channel. And his sister Viona has promised to give anyone a big reward that reports whoever is involved in the situation now. Do you hear me? Hello? Nancy? Nancy! Come on, Nancy. Stop crying. Please talk to me. Oh, they're going to take me to jail. They're going to put me to jail. I, I don't want to spend the rest of my life in jail. I, 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 I don't want to. I need protection. I need protection. I need protection. Oh. Okay. Listen to me. No one is taking you to jail. Nobody knows anything. The universe knows. I took something from the universe. And now it needs to be compensated in kind. Nancy, you have to come back home. We will pull through this together, okay? Just come back home. Please. Dreams are just a defect of sleep. Consciousness is just an irregularity of being awake. Reality is just an illusion. I have to pierce the veil of Maya. Listen, I need to contact Guru Shama immediately. Nancy, listen to me. This is not the right time to lose your head. Please come home. Hello? Nancy? Hello? What happened? Oh, was she hunger? No, you have to call her again. I'm sure she's about to do something. Nancy, you can do this. You can do this. Hello, Guru Shama. It's me, Nancy. Nancy Olere. Guru, 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 I need you. I need your help right now. I, I, I need something bad and I need your help right now, please. I need your help.
Is it real? No. Now she's on another call with someone else. She would definitely call back. I am sure she's on the phone with Guru Shama. I hope she doesn't tell him everything. We need to split right away. Here is not safe anymore. Uh, wait. Wait, wait. Guru, that was how it happened. It was an accident. I'm not a killer. I'm not a killer. I, 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 I can't explain how it happened, but please, I need your protection. Please, I need your help. Guru, please, you need to save me. I don't want to go to prison. I don't want to go to prison. Please, you need to save me. Yes, it, it, it's, in, it's, it's in a bag next to me here. Okay, okay. Right away. I'm bringing it right away, right away now.
said, can you just hurry up? We don't have time. I'm coming as fast as I can. Tessa! I'm coming. What is, what is keeping this girl? We don't have time. Hello? Hello? This is Nancy. Nancy Olere. I'm calling to report myself. I, 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 uh, I killed Desmond. I killed Desmond. But it was an accident. I swear to you, it, it was an accident. I only did it in self-defense. It was an accident. I didn't mean to kill him. I... Okay. I'm driving down to the station right now. I'm, I'm coming. I'm coming right now. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm, I'm coming right now. I didn't mean to... I didn't, I didn't mean to kill him. I didn't mean to kill him. I didn't mean to kill him. <laughs> It was a accident. I didn't mean to kill him. Kama has caught up with me. Kama has caught up with me. <laughs> This place is no more safe for us. I think we should leave as soon as possible. This minute. Of course. It's not safe. Oh, it's not safe anymore, but... Where exactly is safe right now? I don't even know. I don't know. We do not have money. There is no money anywhere. We don't have any money 
right now. Hey, I've still got those diamonds. Oh, that's so great. Aren't we in enough trouble already? I mean, how could you even think about that? I'm just saying. Who knows? It can last us till we figure out a way to come out of this problem. Do this anymore. I cannot do this anymore. I can't. You can't do what? Live like this. I know, I know you. You must have not learned anything from here. Learned a lot, Nikki. But I'm going back to my father's land. I'm going back to my parents' farm. Yes. What? Is that all you've got to say? What? Come on, girl. This is not the life. That has never been the plan. It's not the life for you. Oh, Nikki. I'd rather go back to the village. I'd rather live on the farm than live in jail. Or maybe somewhere worse. Or probably running up and down. I'm not doing this anymore. And I was thinking, why don't you come with me? Let's go back to my place. Yeah, it's not so glamorous, but then it's a life at least. Are you being serious right now? Yes. Listen, your parents aren't around and my parents will be glad to take both of us in. Understand? We can start up from there. Never! That's not the life I want for myself. I can never go back to live in the village. Never! This could be our last chance. This right here, now, could be the last opportunity we have to leave. This could be the last opportunity we have to start up a genuine life. Please. Come on, girl. Don't say no, please. I appreciate your effort. Mm -hmm. I appreciate your concern towards me. But I can't go back to live in a village. That's not the life I want for myself. That's not a vision. I have I have dreams. But you know what? You can go. Just don't worry about me. I can take care of myself. Okay? Mm. 
Nothing is hidden under the sun. Nothing is meant to last for a while. And boom, everybody knows. And you will bury your face in shame. Why would you make people believe? Hey, why don't they see? Everybody who's ready to listen to you. What sort of human would keep on living a fake life? There's no profit in living a fake life. Oh, would you prefer people to love you for who you are than the fake life? Yeah, there is nothing to gain when you live in a fake life. Nothing is hidden under the sun. Listen to me, officers. Listen, see, I am not the only one involved in this. Eh? Young, the only one. young lady, quiet. We know all the people involved in this. And we are gradually arresting all of them. So, what plays with us? Young lady, the case established against you is too massive. Show us the owner of that shop, that pop shop. And doing so, you are securing your freedom little by little. Okay, so how do you want me to help? Just come with us. Point at the man, tell us he is the person. And we are good. Okay? Okay, that's what you want. Fine. Officer. Okay, sir. Nothing is hidden under the sun. Nothing is meant to last for a while. And boom, everybody knows. And you will bury your face in shame. Why would you make people believe? Went on to deceive everybody who's ready to listen to you. What sort of human would keep on living a fake life? Yeah. There's no profit in living a fake life. Oh, would you prefer people to love you for who you are than the fake life? Yeah. There is nothing to gain when you live in a fake life. Oh, nothing is hidden under the sun. Nothing is meant to last for a while. And boom, everybody knows. And you will bury your face in shame. Why would you make people believe? Hey, went on to deceive. Everybody who's ready to listen to you. What sort of human would keep on living a fake life? Yeah. There's no profit in living a fake life. Oh. Would you prefer people to love you for who you are than the fake life? Yeah. There is nothing to gain when you live in a fake life.
Obsession. 